Hi guys, George here from Mac Academy and today I'm going to be reviewing Xbox Smart Glass on my iPhone 5. Xbox Smart Glass is a great new app from Windows and it actually connects up your iPhone to your Xbox like a remote control. Now when you first open Xbox Smart Glass you'll have to log in with your Xbox ID but where I've already done that it connects me straight up. You'll notice it's not made for the iPhone 5 screen yet but hopefully that will come with a future update. So, when you open Xbox Smart Glass, the first thing you come up with is your home page. It shows you where you're at on your screen. It also gives you an option to go into the remote here. It shows you your recent games and other apps you may have used on Smart Glass or on your Xbox. If you scroll to the right by one, it brings you to your social. If I bring this up a little bit closer. It shows your me, your name, and your gamer points. You can see which friends are online or what they've recently been playing. You can check your messages or you can change settings for Smart Glass. If you scroll right again, it takes you to your recent and you see a longer list of what you've recently done on your Xbox. And on the last page is a bit extra for you to discover what's around on Xbox at the minute. So let's go ahead Oh, and if you swipe, swipe to the left once, you get a Bing search bar. Okay, so let's go ahead and open up the remote. Now the remote screen looks like this. You have your X, Y and B buttons in the three corners. And the middle is a scrolling area and is also your A button. So if I wanted to scroll across to social, I swipe from left to right. And it flicks through to my social my games. If you don't want to go through all these different settings you can of course scroll up to the top and scroll between the sections easily and quickly. Now once you find the app you're looking for, we're going to go for Internet Explorer this time, you just tap the middle to use the A button to deploy that app. I've been using uh, Xbox Smart Glass now for a couple of days and I actually use it to, uh, to play my DVDs a lot easier. As you can see here, if you move your finger around the screen, the mouse on the, uh, on the Xbox moves around and you can use it to select whatever you want. Um, I use Xbox Smart Glass mainly as a remote when I'm playing movies because if you're like me, you find when you play movies on your Xbox, it's a bit of a pain to keep picking up, resyncing your controller, using going through the settings with the, with the toggles and the buttons. So I use Xbox Smart Glass just as basically a TV remote to when I'm when I'm watching DVDs on my Xbox. Um, Xbox Smart Glass is free. Um, you have to have a Wi-Fi enabled Xbox or a Wi-Fi dongle if you've got an older Xbox like I have. You also have to have an Xbox Live subscription. So if you haven't got either of those, I'd suggest you go ahead and get one of those subscriptions first. But uh, what, if you've already got that and you have an iPhone, this will work on um, on most iPhones. It's a great little great little app to use. There you go. If I go to my my details, it tells me about Xbox 360 dashboard and and Smart Glass itself. It's a great app. Um, so yeah, go and buy it. If you've like if you like this video and it's helped you out, please um, please click the like button at the bottom subscribe to my channel and if you know other people that this video might help feel free to share it about tweet about it put it on their facebook wall whatever um yeah keep a lookout for the next video and thank you for watching